شیطان رجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم مائی ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس السلام علیکم ٹو آل آف یو آئی ہوپ دیٹ یو آل آر ڈوئنگ ویل دس از یور انگلش ٹیچر مس جویریا ود انادر انٹرسٹنگ ٹیکس ٹاپک ٹوڈے ڈیئر اسٹوڈینٹس ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈو اے کامپریہینشن الانگ ود سم کوشچن اینڈ آنسرس بٹ ایٹ فرسٹ وی ہیو ٹو انڈرسٹینڈ واٹ از اے کامپریہینشن آئی انڈرسٹینڈ واٹ آئی ریڈ Dear students, whenever we read something, these things come in our mind. What am I feeling? What am I thinking? What am I seeing? What am I wondering? And what am I noticing? Dear students, whenever we read something, we imagine these things. We notice, we see, we think and we feel. Today, we have a very interesting comprehension topic. Can you see this beautiful and colorful desert? Yes, or today's comprehension topic is the painted desert. So at first, I'm going to read out this paragraph for you. The painted desert located in Arizona covers 93,500 acres and stretches over 160 miles. It is called painted because it has colored rocks that look like they were painted. This colorful desert has cliffs and hills. It also has trees that turned to stone long ago. These trees are located in a place called the Petrified Forest. My dear students, now we have to understand this paragraph. This paragraph is about a painted desert that is located in Arizona. It covers about 93,500 acres and stretches over 160 miles. It is called the painted desert because the rocks that are present there are colorful. They look like that they were painted. This colorful desert had some cliffs and it has some hills also and they are also colored as you have already seen in the picture that the hills and cliffs are also colored. It also has trees that turned to stone long ago. These trees are located in a place called the Petrified Forest. Now my dear students, we are going to do some question answers related to this comprehension. All right kids, now I am going to read out the question first and then we are going to find out the answers. The first question for this paragraph is, Where is the painted desert located? The next question is, Why is it called painted? The third question is, How many acres of land does it cover? The fourth question is, How many miles long is the painted desert? The next question is, Name two things you might see in the painted desert. And the last question which is given here is, What happened to some of the trees here? Dear students, we have to find out the answers of these questions from the paragraph that we just read out, the painted desert. So come and let's find out the answers now. All right, kids, now we are going to answer the questions. The first question that was given is, where is the painted desert located? The answer for this question is, it is located in Arizona. The next question that is given is, why is it called painted? The answer of this question is, it is called painted because it has colored rocks that look like they were painted. The next question that is given here is, how many acres of land does it cover? The answer for this question is, It covers 93,500 acres. The fourth question is, how many miles long is the painted desert? The answer is, it is 160 miles long. The next question is, name two things you might see in the painted desert. The answer is, cliffs and hills. The last question that is given here is, What happened to some of the trees here? The answer for this question is, the trees turned to stone long ago. 
my dear students you have to do this work in your copy very neatly you have to understand the comprehension very well and you must try to find out the answers by yourself you can change the answers like you can use your own wordings for the answers you don't have to copy this you can also do this by your own i hope that you have enjoyed my today's lesson you have understood the comprehension well I will get you next week inshallah with another lesson till then take care allah hafiz goodbye